Hey, it's the 12th of June. And uh, I'm in New York for the Games for Change conference. Uh, when I got here, I locked myself in the hotel room at the Chelsea Hotel for three days. To make this 10 minute film, which a lot of you might have seen, and it's on the website uh, down on the column down there somewhere. There was a bit of a rush, but I got the editing done. I made it to New York, and I'm very excited about the Games for Change conference. I was surrounded by about 400 people at the conference who all do games for change, and everyone does social projects that involve games and Web 2.0 technology. Unfortunately, I came away incredibly excited, knowing uh, very much how unique we were in so many aspects. Um, linking climate change to cities to kids creativity within the context of a games for change and the way we're doing it within an, with the international perspective and the 10 cities it was all very unique and got loads of great reception gave out uh, lots of DVDs of that film that, that I made. In a few hours I get a train to meet with Matt Costello, a uh, big time game designer and writer. You know, a really great contact and got on fantastically with him. He was amazingly helpful and wonderful, um, really responsive. And we had uh, dinner and um, met his wife, who was great too. And um, we went for a drink and had a, even a little brainstorm about the project. Came up with the whole thing moved a giant leap forward. It was absolutely fantastic. That was a little tour around the place that I'm staying. Um, it's called Ramscale Studios. It's an uh, artist community from the 70s that's um, still holding strong in an entire building, in fact. That tour was only half of the property. Um, flew down to the Virgin Islands, uh, see my mum and dad quickly. Um, I'm sitting in the spot where this project first started, and I wrote up that first big document that I sent out to everyone, from which I got Therese and a team and the whole thing built. It's actually my mum's kitchen. Yesterday I had a big Skype chat with um, uh, two guys in Germany, very good friends, Hans and Frederick, and they are um, coming into the team in terms of brainstorming business plans and funding options while I go to, at, well, I'll be in Africa, and that's my next move on Saturday. I uh, do some filming on a TV show, which uh, helps to fund all of this stuff up till now um, but those guys we had a great Skype chat and I think I'm um, very confident that we've got loads of stuff to work on in terms of funding for uh, a basic prototype which should be fairly cheap to do we figured out a great cheap way to do it and um, we're all working hard on, on Teresa's doing tons of stuff and I'm writing game uh, player experience for this uh, browser browser version and uh, there's um, a very clear idea now exactly how it's going to work and how we're going to aggregate the different after-school groups and uh, we're going to incorporate uh, news feeds into this thing um, and there's uh, various timed elements within the game so it's very exciting to get just that that close to it uh, so um, when I go off to, off to Africa I um, hope that I'll have enough internet connection to keep these vlogs up and keep more connected um, but if not uh, you might be seeing a little bit more from Therese and the other guys so uh, Keep uh, checking it out and thanks once again everyone for fantastic support.